Hello, I am Alvaro Trigo and I am the creator of FullPage.js. In this tutorial I'm going to explain you how to create basic animations uh, between sections using CSS. The result of this uh, tutorial is going to be this basic uh, animation with a picture of sweets. Okay, so to start with it, um, I have downloaded uh, the plugin which is here and I have created in it in this folder um, the file demo.html in which we are gonna be creating our uh, structure to work with the full page.js um, right now I have a basic structure I'm gonna save this and I'm gonna show it to you so this is what we have a basic implementation of full page.js just three sections, no background colors, no pictures, anything. We're going to add an image here in the section too. We're going to be working with it, this image today, some suites. To do so, we are going here in the section two. And we are going to move this down. And to create the image. We are going to be using the ID suites to be able to work with CSS and whenever we need. Um, if I save this right now, the website would look like this. The suites are not exactly, exactly where we want. We want to place them in the bottom of the site. So we are going to be using a position absolute to make it easier to place the image wherever we want inside the section. To do so, we are going to work here with the position relative, oh sorry, position absolute, and the section, which is the container, the wrapper of our image, will have to have position relative. This is like this because we want to position our suites uh, relative to the section itself and not to the document. So if here we say bottom zero pixels, now the suites will be at the bottom of our second section as you can see not at the bottom of the document itself now we're going to place them center in the web in the website horizontally so we're going to say left zero right zero margin zero alto okay like this we have the picture in the middle we have some troubles here because the text is behind the picture so we're just going to move the picture a bit down to solve this problem instead of bottom zero pixels let's say minus 40 pixels and fine we have it where we want we can see in the third section the picture is still being a bit visible at the top we will solve that later um fine so to start creating animations the animation we want to create um we, we want to move the suites from the bottom of the page and until they reach this position we have right now. So to do so, we are going to position them initially where we want, for example, minus 400 pixels. They are not in the screen yet, they are hidden in the third section. That's what, we're, what we are going to do in this example. And whenever we reach the second section, we are going to animate them to the top. Fine, how are you going to work with CSS animations? Well, um, full page um, offers um, the possibility of work working uh, with classes um, every time we change a section um, a class is added to the body which in this case it's prefixed with the text fp viewing and then the index of, of the section in this case zero if i move one section down now we see we have fp viewing one and this will be changing in real time whenever we go up or down in our page so if we want in the section 2 which is fp viewing 1 to position the suites at the bottom of the screen we just have to use fp viewing 1 and then suites and then we are gonna copy and paste bottom 40. This would move the picture from one position to the other, as we are going to see now. 
there, there. Very good. But there's no animation. To do so, we just need to create the basic uh, animation, a transition. Transition all one second point one, and then the is in is out, and then four five four for um web kit sorry, web kit um transition all one point one seconds is out. This way we will have it working almost. Let's see. There we go. We have problems in the third section, but as we can see from the section 1 to the section 2, it works as we expected. For the third section, what we are going to do is just move the suites again to the second one. We are just going to move them to the bottom of the second section. So, whenever they read section 3, read, well, let's put a comment here. Reading section 3. This was for section 2. Remember that the index of the section starts by 0. That's why the section 2 has index 1 and the section 3 index 2. So whenever we reach the third section, we are going to move again the picture to the bottom of the second section. And hopefully we have it working now. That's perfect. Very well. Um, you can even add a navigation, for example, navigation through and see how it works exactly the same. We have added the navigation in the right, navigation bullets, um, second section, we have the animation there, disappear. Well, that's it. As you see, something quite simple, doesn't require um, much code. And uh, working with CSS is always like a great alternative to um, working directly with the Doom structure. And I think uh, it's a nice way to make animations. Thanks for um, seeing the video. Uh, if you have any trouble doing it, uh, just place a comment on it. And um, well, feel free to donate. Uh, to keep improving full page.js. Thanks.